Hi friends, welcome to my channel Optometry Online. The topic for today's video is MCQ questions of conjunctiva. Let's go to the first question. Red, sore, painful eye with yellow discharge and matting of lashes is seen in which of the following condition? Options are bacterial conjunctivitis, viral conjunctivitis, allergic conjunctivitis, toxic conjunctivitis. The answer is bacterial conjunctivitis. Viral conjunctivitis usually has a viral uh, watery kind of discharge. Mucoid discharge is seen in VKC and keratoconjunctivitis and mucopurulin discharge is seen in chlamydial infection. Second question, ALS line, a dense linear scar in upper lid margin is seen in option trachoma, vernal conjunctivitis, allergic conjunctivitis, herpes simplex. The answer is A, trachoma. So in trachoma, there is a chronic conjunctival inflammation and there is a scarring of conjunctiva which is called as ALS line. Third question. Superior limbic keratoconjunctivitis is associated with which of the following systemic condition? The options are diabetes, hypertension, thyroid dysfunction, option D, rheumatoid arthritis. The answer is thyroid dysfunction and is usually affected, uh, affects usually most middle-aged women and uh, thyroid dysfunction is the most common associated factor with for superior limbic keratoconjunctivitis. Fourth question, the features of vernal conjunctivitis are all except Diffuse conjunctival congestion, follicles, mucopurulin discharge, preauricular lymphadenopathy. The answer is option C, mucopurulin discharge. VKC usually has a mucus kind of discharge. Which of the following is not a cause of subconjunctival hemorrhage? Nodular episcleritis, valsalva, trauma, anticoagulant. The answer is option A, nodular episcleritis, whereas all the other options usually has a associated with subconjunctival hemorrhage. Pigmented iron line in pterygium is called as dashed line. Alts line, stalker's line, Ferry's line, Sampolisi line. The answer is option B, stalker's line. So, stalker's line is iron deposition in corneal epithelium located at the leading edge of pterygium. It can vary from yellow to golden brown. Okay. Next question. Safe strategy is used for which condition? Diabetic retinopathy, viral conjunctivitis, Glaucoma, trachoma. The answer is option D, trachoma. Safe strategy aims to stop the spread of blinding trachoma through surgery, antibiotics, facial cleanliness and environmental improvements. Next question. Simblephron is seen in all cases except trachoma, Stephen Johnson, corneal ulcer, atopic conjunctivitis. The Stephen Johnson, uh, sorry, simblephron is a condition where the bulba and the palatal conjunctiva usually form an abnormal adhesion and it is seen in all the other conditions except corneal ulcer. Conjunctival pseudo membrane is seen in which of the following condition? Bacterial, adenoviral, chlamydial, cicatrice of pemphigoid. The answer is option B, adenoviral. Uh, a true membrane is inflammatory exudate. Involving superficial layer of the inflamed conjunctival epithelium, when you attempt to peel the membrane, it can usually cause tearing and bleeding. But whereas the pseudomembrane is a coagulated exudate, which is attached to the epithelium and it is very easy to peel, it doesn't have any bleeding underneath. So, which is seen in adenoviral and ligneous conjunctivitis. Next question. All the features are true about true pterygium except present in palpebral conjunctiva, progressive in nature, above presence above the age of 40 years and probe can be passed. So the option is the probe can be passed uh, is a false answer because in the, it is a in true pterygium, the it is, uh, pterygium is very densely attached and the probe cannot be passed. Which preservative in eye drop can cause damage to the conjunctival epithelial cells? The options are polycarterineum, benzalconium chloride, oxochloro complex, hydrogen peroxide. The answer is benzalconium chloride. A painful, tender, non-itchy, localized redness of conjunctiva can be due to bulba spring catara, episcleritis, pterygium, plicton. The answer is episcleritis. Coming to next question. Management of bite out spot in child weight 8 kilos and more. So which is the following option? Options are 2 lakh international units of vitamin A on day 114, 1 lakh units on day 1 and 14. 2 lakh international units on day 1 to 40, 
1 lakh international units on days 1 to 14. So the answer is 2 lakh international units on days 1, 2 and 14. So this is usually seen in xerophthalmia due to vitamin A deficiency and can cause night blindness. So treatment regimen includes of uh, 2 lakh international units on days 1, 2 and 14. If the child is less than 8 kilos of weight, then it is 1 lakh unit on days 1, 2 and 14. So next question. Giant papillary conjunctivitis is seen in which of the following conditions? Contact lens use, viral conjunctivitis, toxic conjunctivitis, Perinod's oclo syndrome. The answer is contact lens use. It is because of the allergens and irritants which can cause the uh, papillary conjunctivitis which is built up on the contact lens. Next question. Limbal dermoid in seen in which of the following condition? Golden hair, Down syndrome, Marfan syndrome, Mehela Danlos. The answer is Golden hair syndrome. Uh, it is a congenital disease. It is a, it, it uh, features of epibulbar dermoids. Microphthalmia, coloboma, and the other features, systemic features are vertebral anomalies and preauricular ear tags and hearing loss. Next question Which of the following are true about benign conjunctival nevus except uh, present in bulba conjunctiva, well demarcated one, uh, highly pigmented, requires close observation? The answer is. Highly pigmented is a false one because the degree of pigmentation can vary over time. All of following are true about the follicles except localized aggregation of lymphocytes. It can be because of viral chlamydial toxic reaction occurs in all ages, appears as discrete lesions with pale center. The answer is occurs in all ages because the follicle doesn't develop before three months of age. Next question. The most common cause of uh, virus uh, in viral conjunctivitis is adenovirus, measles, rubella, herpes. The answer is adenovirus. Which of the following conjunctivitis is associated with higher risk of conelectasia? Bacterial, viral, vernal, toxic. The answer is vernal conjunctivitis because it has got a higher incidence of developing pulsed marginal degeneration, keratoconus and keratoglobus. Next question. Which of the following tumors is seen in HIV patients? Conjunctival papilloma, conjunctival lymphoma, pyogenic granuloma, and Kaposi sarcoma. The answer is Kaposi sarcoma. So coming to the last question. Which division of conjunctiva is loose and redundant so that it swells easily? Bulbar conjunctiva, palpable conjunctiva, pornicial conjunctiva, none of the above. The answer is pornicial conjunctiva. That's all for the video today. If you like my video, kindly like, share and subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching.